So the way chemotherapy was developed was to target cells that are actively growing at any point in time. That doesn't matter if it's your hair cell, a cell in your mouth, your blood cell, or a tumor cell. Chemotherapy targets cells that are actively growing and kills cells that are actively growing. It's non-selective. But then what we really started to realize is, you know what? The best way to target a tumor may be to harness our own immune system. So now we've actually come up with a way we can actually take our own T-cells from you, from me, and we can actually genetically modify them to target our own tumor. What that means though is it means that we have to find a marker on that tumor that's unique to that tumor and not unique to other normal tissue and then take our own T-cells, our own immune system, and genetically modify it to target just that uh, marker on that tumor. Uh, this therapy called uh, CART therapy, stands for Chimeric Antigen Receptor Therapy, T-cell therapy, is just that. And in fact, in many ways, we view this as the face of cancer therapy to come. It's often amazing, we've had several patients that we've treated here with CART therapy. Uh, you can tell that the, that the T-cells are doing their job because these patients will be running high fevers and then all of a sudden, boom, one day it just breaks. The day that it breaks is the day that for us, that the immune system said, all right, I'm done killing the leukemia cells. No more leukemia cells to kill. And the child wakes up and says, all right, I'm feeling better now. In some ways, it's almost like waking up from a uh, bad case of the flu where you wake up and say, all right, I feel better now. It's not something that can be just done at any hospital, in any clinic, anywhere. We are the only hospital in the state of Michigan that is proud to offer CART therapy for children with acute lymphoblastic leukemia.